All right, Ruby Mae. Yeah. How you doing tonight? Good. We got We're you. On a camera drive. We got you bundled in there, don't we? Yeah. Yes. So I got you in our favorite new blanket. Yeah. Because I wanted for our future real estate mogul training episode two to do my blanket recommendations. So I thought, where could we uh, don a blanket on a nice uh, evening here in downtown Indy and talk about blanket recommendations? One, don't buy a house in a floodplain. What's a floodplain? A floodplain is where it's likely that the water will come into your house. That doesn't sound like a good idea, does it? Mm -hmm. No. Number two, is don't buy a house on a septic system. Septic? Yeah, do you know what a septic is? What's that? Uh, a septic receives all the sewage. What's sewage? I knew that would be your next question. <laughs> sewage is what happens when you flush a toilet. Ew. Yucky, isn't it? Yeah. So, don't buy a house on a septic if the lot size is under an acre. So a septic on a large lot is fine. A septic on a small lot, not a good idea. And thirdly, I recommend don't buy a block wall basement. So we have blocks. No, we have a basement, right? Yeah. But our basement is a poured concrete basement. So in the old days, they would uh, stack up block to make your basement. Whereas today we pour concrete and Again, there's exceptions to all these rules, but in general, block wall basements, I've been in a bazillion of them, and most of them have problems with uh, seepage and bowing and cracking and, you know, all those sorts of things. So, let's summarize. What are the three blanket recommendations that I've shared with you tonight? What was the first one? Has to do with water. Don't buy a water plane. A flood plane. Don't buy in a flood plane. What was the second one? Uh, what? It starts with an S, I think. S, yes. It has to do with suck. toilet flushing. No, like suck. A, like it goes to the thingy. The septic. Septic. Don't buy on a septic if the lot's under an acre. And what was the third one? No brick basement. Yeah, uh, block wall basements. Yeah, stay away from block wall basements. So those are my three blanket recommendations why that's you why you're wrapped blanket? in a blanket oh, okay. <laughs> all right rue that was fun did you have fun yes yeah me too you want to go get some boba tea up here sure i would get you hot chocolate but i know you're not a chocolate gal what it's just gross that's so weird ruby yeah, and so uh, we've enjoyed coming out here to Coco Bubble Tea, my first time. Love it. Appreciate these guys being uh, gracious to us. So again, if we can help you with your real estate needs, give me a ring, 317-216-TONY. Yep. Thanks so much. See you next time. So, Ruby Mae, what do you think are the odds that you join the family business and sell real estate? When out you of up? 10? Yeah, one out of 10. What would you give it? Uh, a four. A four? That's not a very strong odd. Well, so you want to do our closing? What's that? That's where we talk to the camera. Um, we'll just talk to you. Oh, okay. You just talk to me. Fair enough.